Hey guys, Nick, aka okay, the one only Crisis YT, and today's video is a question and answer video, and that's pretty much it. I'm going to be giving you my answers to your questions I got on Twitter. These are actually some basic questions. There was a lot of good questions that I, I skipped over. You might be like, why, 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 why? I might come back and do some of those, and I might not, because one of the reasons is I accidentally unfavorited a lot of them. So if you guys sent me a question on Twitter, chances are it was going to be used, but, uh, I kind of unfavorited it by accident, and I apologize about that. So uh, I'm going to give you guys some a way to make that up. So if you guys sent me a question on Twitter, or if you didn't, you can post a comment in the comment section down below asking me a question, and I might use it next week on another question and answer video. So that's today's question of the day. What is your question for me? Tell me in the comment section down below, and uh, I might just answer it next Friday in a question and answer video. Nevertheless... I just jump into this question and answer video. The first question is from Pro Fei. I think that's how you say his name. And he asked, what gave me the inspiration to start YouTube? And it's simple. Hutch and Seenators. Those two guys gave so many people a reason to start, and I was one of them. I was the reason. They were the reason I started. They were the guys who I first watched and was like, wow, these guys, these guys seem like they like what they're doing. These guys seem cool and fun and energetic. I can be cool and fun and energetic and talk over video games. I'm going to do that. So I got a Dazzle at the time and, and started making videos of my Turtle Beaches and then upgraded to a PVR and then now I have a Blue Snowball microphone. And that was a great segue to the next question, which is from Got Dim Beats. And he asked, what kind of microphone do I use? And it is a Blue Snowball. If anyone is getting into commentaries, this is the best mic that you can pretty much get for a cheaper price. It's only like $60. And so it's an incredible mic that you can get and it sounds perfectly Exactly like your real life voice does. Astros, A30s, A40s, and I think there's like an A50 or A60 now. They, Those work. Those are really good gaming headsets that'll work. But Turtle Beaches, uh, Tritons, those really don't work that well uh, to do commentaries. But Astros can do quite well with commentaries. And uh, Blue Snowballs are very good as well. It just depends on how much money you're willing to spend. And if you're looking to get Astros anytime in the future or not. You might want to just save up and get Astros. But uh, I would recommend getting the Blue Snowball. I love them. They're great. They're durable. I dropped mine off a car one time, and, and it's pretty good. So, nevertheless, the next question is, Hi, I'm Cal, and he asks, Do you play Crisis 2 or Crisis? Um, not currently. I have in the past. I don't play them anymore. I beat Crisis 2 campaign, and it was like, Okay, this game's done for me. The multiplayer on that game really wasn't that great. And a lot of people ask, Was that where you got your name from? Yes, it was. I did get my name from the video game Crisis. But uh, I really don't enjoy the series that much. The campaign on Crisis 2 was pretty good. Never played Crisis 1, but the multiplayer on Crisis 2 just is terrible, in my opinion. That's in my opinion, but uh, I just don't enjoy it. And, of course, I've only experienced on the console, so you PC elitists might be like, Crisis 2 is incredible on a PC, you fag! But what I've seen on the Xbox, it's not that great. So there you go. I don't really enjoy Crisis, but that is where I got my name. I might I might do a whole separate video about that, because there is actually a lot of story that went into me picking the name Crisis. Uh, but nevertheless, the next question is from Thomas735 Gaming, and he asks, What was the first game that you ever played on any console? And it was Super Mario Brothers. I'm doing it off the top of my head. This was Super Mario Brothers on the Nintendo Entertainment System, on the NES. So, uh, yeah, a while back. This was like in 1995. I was like four years old. And I was playing, not 1995, 1999, and I was four years old, and I, my brother hooked up. He had a PS1, but he hooked up the Nintendo because he was just getting bored of the PS1, I guess. And so he hooks up the Nintendo. I went out over to his room, and he was playing the Nintendo. I was like, what is this? This is awesome. But um, that's just stories that I've heard that I extremely loved that Mario uh, that day, and I, that's when I fell in love with it, and I was always asking, asking to play Mario from that point on, but I don't remember any of that. That's what I've been told. The first video game I remember playing was Grand Theft Auto 3 on the PlayStation 2. So, there you go. Nevertheless, the next question is from Vanquished9, and he asks, would you ever think of doing YouTube full-time? The answer to that question is yes. Currently, I am doing YouTube full-time. This is the only thing that I'm doing as to make money right now is YouTube. So, you know, technically I'm doing it full-time. But, uh, nevertheless, yeah, if the opportunity arose to where I could make enough to support myself and make a living off of YouTube, I would do it. And the next question and final question is from for Eva Brooke. And she asked, if you could be an animal, what would it be? I would be a, 
I had this thought out. I thought about this question. I would be a turtle. And the reason is because they have, like, no wor worries in the world except getting food, and they live forever. So that's why I would be a turtle, because you can live forever, and there's really no worries. So, nevertheless, the next question, wait, what? The question of the day, so it is a question, is what is what are your questions for me? Tell me in the comment section down below, and I'll answer them next Friday in a question and answer video. Now, of course, if I don't pick your question, guess what? I will answer it in the comment section down below. So you will get an answer to your question even if I don't use it in the question and answer video. So yeah, guys, I'm Crisis YT. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps me out. If we can get this video to 30 likes, that'd be awesome. Um, but yeah, guys, I'm Crisis YT, and I'm out. Peace.